Sidra is one of around 30 students reading The Fox and the Crow in Arabic at this refugee camp school in Iraqi Kurdistan. For this young Syrian Kurd who arrived here in April, the chance to attend school is a golden opportunity. I love studying. I love coming to school and playing with my friends. Not everyone at the Demise camp is as lucky. Among the nearly 50,000 refugees here is Abdul Hamid. The 12 year old sells ice cream to help pay for his father's medication. My mother, sister, brother, and I arrived here without money. I have to work. More than 2,000 refugees arrive at the camp every week. Though it's relatively well equipped, Domiz is struggling under the pressure of the rapidly increasing numbers. We cannot uh, construct uh, more schools which are really needed. We cannot construct more uh, shelters. Uh, at the moment, we are providing tents and, and you know, the facilities that come with uh, shelter, like the sanitation units, uh, toilets, uh, showers and connect them to water. With the punishing heat of summer here, camp officials are fearful of overcrowding. They are now preparing for a possible outbreak of communicable diseases, especially cholera. And as the Syrian conflict rages, the flood of refugees from across the border is unlikely to stop soon.